Hey y'all, welcome to Horrible Gaming. My name is Nora and on today's video we are starting a new possible island theme. As many of y'all know, I just finished up my Christmas city so obviously I'm looking for a new island to work on for the channel and I'm kind of shocked that I wasn't inspired after all to do something winter related. Now I did consider today's build to be set during the winter but I was looking on Pinterest for codes and I came across this incredible road design it just like took my breath away and I thought that this would be the absolute perfect road design for a antique kind of like fishing town and I thought that this would be such a fun theme because I'm getting the castle city itch that I've been really wanting to do for several months and of course I'm making use of a lot of the boat and fishing items y'all know those are my favorite if you're one of my regular followers anyways I hope today's build inspires you to pick up the game again and start playing I'm kind of shocked that I did not do something Christmas related for Christmas Eve but you know this is what inspired me and I had so much fun building it and I don't know if y'all really like how this video turned out let me know in the comment section because if I get enough feedback I will definitely continue this theme but I just had so much fun with it and I know in the end it's always important for me to build things that I have you know fun doing and just you know brings me joy but I do always appreciate feedback on every single build that we create on the channel. So as we get started on today's entry, I just want to say quickly, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. I hope everyone has a wonderful time with their friends and family. Let me know what your plans were for this holiday season. We just went and spent time with family and of course we're just going to be relaxing the next couple of days. I don't really have any big plans besides just relaxing. I swear I have not been able to relax for weeks now. The holidays are just so chaotic and I know that like many people, especially content creators share what their new year's resolution is going to be and honestly I just have no idea. If I had to actually choose, I think it would be maybe just to feel a lot more dedicated to the channel. I'm very open about this, but I struggle daily with um, mental illness. So it's like being a content creator with that is just a really difficult uh, combination. The last few months have been really difficult to just like content create and just stream. And it's been stressing me out because I want to be active on the channel, but it's like my brain tells me no. So this upcoming year, I'm just hoping to not let it control me and just be more active on the channel and just have fun and today's video is a result of that I've been so afraid to do a theme like this or just like try it out because I feel like I'm not very good with castle themes I just struggle with them a ton and I just wanted to try it today and see how it went and see how I felt about it and this was the most fun that I've had on Animal Crossing in a really long time I think this theme would be so fun to create so I hope that y'all love it as much as I did today Today. I think it was a really fun trial. There was a lot of content I got done on the island. I also feel like this just really introduced the theme quickly at the entry as well. I normally do grand entries that are like these really crazy road layouts and this was a lot more simple and cluttered from what I normally do and I still think it turned out really nice for being something that's a little bit different and out of my style. If we do this island theme, I think the main goal that I have for it is to use a lot of waterscape. The last few islands that I have created have have used pretty much zero waterscaping and I really do miss adding that onto my islands. To be fair, it's honestly really difficult for me to put waterscape on city islands. I just struggle with it so much. But for an island theme like this, I feel like it's really important. So that is definitely a goal that I have for the island and of course doing like a really nice large park area too. So to introduce a little bit of natural elements to the city island, I decided to do a bridge here that kind of angles a little bit and I thought that that could actually transition maybe over to the park area. but. I I also thought that doing like a double bridge uh, look would be really nice, especially around the entry. So I will actually be placing a second bridge that kind of like frames in the area and connects to the boat docks later on in the video. Just a heads up, I changed my mind on decor and the layout a bajillion times throughout this video. There will be quite a bit of transitions just because this whole entire entry took me several hours to build. So just be ready to see a lot of transitions, but I'm very excited with 
with how the bridges ended up looking later on. I just think it was such a pretty hint of color to the build and just really like brought some more life into it as well. As usual, if we make this island, I have no idea what my plans are for builds and just for layout. I wing every single build that I do and kind of just go with the flow. The main entry was actually inspired by this incredible creator I saw on Pinterest. They actually made this really nice winter code, which is what was kind of tempting me on doing a winter port island. So I took inspiration from actually the code that they posted advertising the design. So I'll have them linked in the video's description so y'all can go check them out. And like always, every single code that I use today will be found in the video's description too. I've seen a lot of comments asking where the codes are and you have to scroll at the very bottom of the video's description. I always have the codes listed at the very bottom of all the text that I put in there. So for future reference, that is where you'll be able to find that always. Of course, if I forgot to list a code or I missed one, just let me know in the comment section and I'll be sure to add it into the video's description. It does happen quite a bit since I changed my mind a bajillion times on my codes. But uh, anyways, we're getting close to the end of this video. I just really hope that y'all enjoyed today as much as I did. I hope that it brings you some inspiration. I'm just really excited with how this feels. It just feels really cozy and rustic already. I just think that this would be such a fun theme to create. Anyways, after some final touches, here is how today's entry turned out. I just think this turned out so pretty and elegant. Let me know what you thought about it in the comment section below and if you hope to see more builds on this island too. With that being said, thank y'all so much for watching. Merry Christmas and I'll see you next video. Have a horrible day.